Hey guys, what's going on? Rockstone Addict 17. I got another video for you here. This time I'm going to do a uh, a contest submission for Yankees cards. Uh, his 200 um, subscriber video contest. He wants to see our top five uh, Yankees cards. Um, I just subscribed to him recently. I just saw that he uh, <clears throat> that he reached 200 subscribers. Uh, so I'm just submitting this video. I haven't been subscribed to him for too, too long. Um, so, you know, I don't know what the contest necessarily entails. I don't remember. I saw the video a few days ago. Um, I don't even care if I'm in consideration for it. I just wanted to show off my top five Yankees cards. Um, so I'll go ahead and get started. Uh, this first one is a pretty simple one. It's a Bernie Williams uh, autograph from Panini Prism. I pulled this out of a pack a while ago. Um, I really liked Bernie Williams growing up. Uh, part of the reason I have this in this top five, I'm not a big Panini fan. It's on sticker. I just know that he's not really signing a whole lot of baseball anymore. Um, so, yeah. Uh, that's card number five. Card number four uh, is this Thurman Munson rookie card. Uh, the Dave McDonald Thurman Munson rookie from 1970 Tops. Um, it's in pretty rough-ish shape. You can see the corners are pretty beat up. Um, but the centering on it is superb. Uh, the back is in fantastic shape. The centering on it is about as good as you're going to get for 1970. You know, it's off a little bit. Um, uh, in this case, it would be right to left, but it's truly top to bottom. Um, but really nice card. Um, one of my favorite rookies, uh, for one of, uh, one of the, the greats in Thurman Munson. Uh, next is this purple CC Sabathia one of one autograph from 2013 tops tribute. Uh, I've always been a big fan of the tribute cards. Uh, I'm sorry for the glare. It's a super shiny card. But yeah, I got this um, in a box break I did um, from uh, the Hobby Box, um, Chris Justice, uh, quite a while ago, four years ago as it were. Um, so really nice CC Sabathia, one of one. Um, just a really nice looking card. The autograph is on sticker, but it's entirely on the sticker, and it has never left this uh, top loader. Um, that Chris sent it to me in. The next one um, that I'm going to show actually came from this same box that the CC Sabathia autograph came from, and it is this Babe Ruth Game Use Bat, number 7 of 99. Really nice card. One of the favorite ones I have in my collection. Um... Just the super, super nice card of Babe Ruth. Uh, definitely one of my, one of the favorite cards in my collection. And then number one, the best Yankees card, in my opinion, that I have. It's definitely my favorite uh, from a guy that I, when I was younger, I didn't really care for. But as I got older, I really appreciated his star and his, uh, his contribution to the game of baseball and how great he truly was. Um... But it's a clear-cut elements autograph game used jersey of Derek Jeter, number one twenty-eight out of three fifty. Uh, I Derek Jeter is a guy I've always wanted to have in my collection. I've had this for several years. Uh, really, really nice card. Again, this is on sticker. It's not on card, but the entirety of his autograph is on the sticker. Um, just a gorgeous card. Definitely one. That's it's definitely probably in the top five of my collection. Um, so yeah, guys, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, congratulations to Yankees Cards again on the 200 subscribers. Uh, that's pretty awesome. Um, and I hope you guys just enjoyed this relatively unimpressive, but uh, still some great cards. Uh, of my top five Yankees cards. So hope everyone's doing well. Again, congratulations to Topps Cards, and I'll talk with you guys later. Peace.